Hello. Uh, we have a game. And it is against... I don't know what it's against yet. Let's see. Game 3 with our Chaos Renegades. Against... Oh, sorry. It's going to... might be a little dark in here, especially... Uh, let's see. I think I see a uh, Skaven again, innit? Hmm. We'll see how this goes. We're not really set up to play them yet. What with having those skills. That looks like a lot of the same player, but we'll see. Maybe that's just deceptive. Obviously, our team's pretty easy. We could have a Skaven <clears throat> on our team, but they're more expensive for one speed and minus one... AV, so it felt more sensible to go with what we got. Okay, I see gutter gutter. I see two gutters so far. We'll see what that means. He's got an extra journeyman than us, so I guess he's got a bit bashed up as well. Uh... Hang on, did we skip past the inducements phase? Does that mean we have the exact same thing? Or did I did I skip past it by accident? That was weird. Maybe I skipped past it and I... No, you surely got to hit the button. I, do, I don't know. Anyway, he's gone on defense. I guess he's got no skills. Uh, but he does have journeyman that he's up on the line. This is interesting. Right, oh good. So two gutters. I see... Yep, two blitzers. Alright, and we have no... We have one skill on the elf. And we're having to play the gobbo because our team got bashed up last time. Guess we'll pop our big guys on the line and try and hit some stuff. Put the orc on the line as well. It's good at taking hits. I mean, we could try and go and hit the rat ogre, I suppose, but I'm not sure we want to do that yet. I think I'd rather just work on the the weaker guys. Um. Okay, so that's kind of our setup. Fingers crossed, eh? We'll get underneath that if we can. Very nice. I feel like we've had a lot of high kicks recently. So you can get to there. You can get to there. Let's bring him up to here. Bring this guy down. We'll just do a little protection for the moment. And we'll go blitz this guy. I think we'll do that first. And straight in with the dub skulls. It's an unfortunate start, isn't it? But at least we've got the ball. Could have re-rolled that, obviously. But trying not to. He's gone for the Apo and two re-rolls. Okay. I really wish we could tell what the team value difference was and stuff now, but I don't think it's going to show us. Oh. That was a really weird beginning of the game. I don't know. I don't know what happened there. Uh, maybe it's a thing where if you've got the same team value, uh, it just... Like, maybe we've got the exact same team value and it just skipped us through. I, I don't know. Because I'm wondering if they've put in with the new patch where you can't spend extra money on stuff as a sort of temporary... Uh, claws out of, out of the fact that you can get such a huge bank. I, j I don't know, honestly. Has kind of felt that way, though. Alright, so he's getting offensive. I mean, the gut runners could get down to us, but it's going to involve GFIs. Okay, might be just going for the let's stand up their entire team tactic, which is valid, although arguably a bit risky. I mean, if he doesn't base us, this is only semi-meaningful because obviously we just run up. I guess if... yeah, okay. 
Oh, the right ogre moved. It's unfortunate. He actually passed his animal savagery. Loner on loner. I would kind of like to know that they're loners. That would be a nice... I guess that counts as an innate skill, so... Okay, so the safest thing seems to be to sort of... Well, let's stand some guys up. Uh, it feels like we're a little lacking on players right now. I guess up to here? No, here. This is a bit scary here. Because what I'm planning is this. Blitz. You. Validate. <laughs> okay, this time we're going to re-roll it. Okay, we got a push. What a, what a start, eh? I think we actually stand this guy up, even though he could get surfed. Wow. Rough start to the game, it's got to be said. That's, uh, four skulls, and a both down, and a skull, right? So five skulls and a both down. And I suppose we got and another both down in the push. That's that's horrific dice. So chances are he's getting hit on the ball here. Ooh. I gotta say, right now we're getting a bit diced. I don't think that's entirely unfair to uh, to call that. It's been horrific. But, you know, maybe we can make something happen here. I'll take that. Okay. It's not like full on panic stations yet, but it's not great at the same time. Yep. Why not? I mean, where do we even go from here? How are we so surrounded? How do we have the same amount of players? And yeah, we got this going. Okay, we did kind of need that. Okay, so you're not even getting up. Good work. Okay, okay. Uh, I think we've got to try and reroll this. Nope. <laughs> Not even armor breaking him. This is so bad. This is this is an impressively bad start to a game. I mean, I tried to play it safe. I really did. We need to clear that so we could push up to our other guys up here because we're in obviously we're in the danger zone down here. But oh, we haven't made a good block yet. 
We've had three turns, and each turn has been a complete disaster. I've used two rerolls and still not managed to knock anything down. Whilst also getting all of our own players decimated. It's, it's This is like... The distribution of dice here is... <laughs> is somewhat uh, crazy. There you go, double skulls. They'll be into a pair though. Oh, double skulls into double skulls. Okay, never mind. I take it all back. Boy, do we need something like that. Just when he thought he had us. Hey! Okay, now we're cooking on gas. Uh, boy, how do we get out of here? Is there a player there? There is. I think I've got... I hate to say it, but I think I've got to do this. Okay. And I have to stay, I guess? Oh. This is... This is, like, some of the worst rolling I've... I've had. Okay, at least that dodging is up to snuff. Hey! A full-on pair! I have suspicion that might happen. I mean, at this point, with two KOs and an injury, we've just got to try and get in the end zone, but... It's not... Great. I mean, we've got ourselves into a reasonable position here, at least. That's all we need. We just needed one turn of, like, reasonable pushes to get into a better position, but it's been so hard. Arguably, I shouldn't have used the reroll on the troll, but, like, at the time, that was desperate measures. The fact that he managed to quad skull is, is our one salvation so far. And we're against Skaven, so we're not, if we were against Dwarfs here, I'd be like, well, we're pretty much away and good here. But we're against Skaven, so they, they'll be right back at us here. Dodge is good here. I mean, the gutters in and of themselves aren't as bad. Um, if they're blocked, they would be more of a problem, but... You know, they've got to roll a pair to get us down in a way that helps them out. They haven't blitzed yet. What are they doing? Are they, I guess they're going to do a dodge off blitz. Fails the animal savagery? What's this going to mean? Oh, it just means that he doesn't do anything. Okay. Is he just going to blitz that guy? No, he's going to do the dodge. The <laughs> double pairs. Shouldn't have moved this guy. He didn't need this guy. Should have left him and then he could have come and tried to pick up the ball. Pick it up. Uh, where can I move this guy? I'm trying to find a way to get him out of the way so I can get an assist in here. If I hit him and then go here, this guy can... Okay. 
That's not what we were looking for. This team is, is so painful. I just can't get anything going. I mean, I know that sounds silly after we won our first two games, but it's so they're so rough. We did lose a game before we won our first two games as well. Uh, I mean, it's just trying to get anything going, like get a block going. It's so hard. Like, the idea was if we knock this guy over, we have an assist here, we can blitz and grab the ball again. Um... But, uh, yeah, it's not, not great. I will take a push, although that does free up this guy. Is he going to try and knock the ogre over? I guess. Yep. That gives him a two dice with this guy. He's going to try and knock both of them over and then come down here, I guess. Which is pretty safe, honestly. It's it's an incredible game. I normally you would get like um double you know quad scold against and you'd think well that's pretty good but with such a bad run is he doing blitzing with this guy? Why wouldn't you make the hit with this guy just in case? And then and then he's one dicing the ogre when oh boy. Okay, I mean the one thing you could say about this is we still we still theoretically have a chance here because he's making some weird decisions. So I think we have to make a troll block here to try and get the orc over. Sure. This is one of those games where you want to see the stats after to see how many skulls and both dance we rolled, because that's that's almost all we've rolled. Okay, so we're going 1-0 down this half and, and there's really nothing we can do about that. So it's just can we can we pull it back to a draw in the second half? It's gonna be tricky, especially as assuming they like we can't if we got down here and put some pressure on, maybe we could have forced a faster score, but now he can stall it out. So we're going to get one go at these KOs. We're, we're four players down for, for no real reason. Um, like, this is, this is desperate times. We're five players down. Uh, maybe, maybe we can, the irony hope is to try and force him to score next turn to get two goes at the KOs, but I, mean, I don't feel super, uh, confident about that because he's got so many players to move that he can just, he, he should block all of our players off. There should be screens in here. I think honestly I'd have moved this guy over here. This guy would have come down here. I mean, I guess that works too. Our, our troll stunned himself as well, which is kind of amusing. If you find such things amusing. Uh, 
I mean, what do you do here? Injury here would be nice. No. So I think we've got to go pressure here. Hitting the gutter runner feels like a good way to sort of show intent. Sure. Just as done. <clears throat> yeah, this is this has been a painful, 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 painful path. <laughs> but hey, it could all change. Oh look, they double scaled. Oh, they still had a reroll. Never mind. You've really got to just try and uh, hold hold it together here. Against somewhat maddening uh, chance. Is he not going to go block this guy? He's going to go blitz that guy, okay. Could have followed and had another block. I don't entirely understand why he didn't. Go on, you can do it. Good push. Doing a blitz here with no reroll. I mean, I suppose you could you could look at it like well, we've used up all the double skulls for the for the thing. I would look at it like this is not something I should do. So there we go. One of the more painful halves I've suffered recently. There's, there's no reason why it should have gone that way. We're down two now and on defense. So, you know, that's not idyllic. I mean, we can't even really... I mean, we're, we're three down here. Three down. <laughs> I mean, we might just lose this one. I mean, it's, it's very much looking that way. I think... I think out of every ten times we play this, we win it more than 50% of the time. Hey, Dweebo, how's it going? Uh, but this is one of... This is the... Uh, 1 out of 10 where it goes, where everything just, uh, self-destructs. Although this team has shown a, a penchant for that, so, uh, I guess, you know, we shouldn't be too surprised. It really does want to kill itself for no reason. I'm in a crazy game, do we be aware? I mean, on paper, it's not crazy. It's basically two non-skilled up teams. No, no. The f uh, what it was is we rolled uh, out of our first three turns, we rolled five skulls, two both downs, and a push, um, which ate up a few rerolls and. Uh, <laughs> 
and then got our own players injured on counter hits. Uh, we had two KOs come back, or this would be even worse. Um, yeah, it was it was a disaster, honestly. There was, and then it kept going like that. I mean, he had a quad skull, and it still wasn't enough to like put things back in into a good place. We were so like every first block of the turn, it was a turnover for us, and probably in the rest of that, there was probably five turns out of eight where our first block ended our turn. And that's not an exaggeration. So, you know, this is where we are. It makes you want to play dwarfs, honestly. Although, we are a lot of skulls, so dwarfs... Dwarfs would have been semi-in trouble, but maybe they'd have got through. He's gone and set up the cage here before bringing the ball. In bronze, it's more about team development. If only that was something we would... But as you can see, we haven't we haven't got any SPP either, so um but yeah, I, I guess that's fair. I still like the record though, right? I know I know technically they don't mean anything, but you know. I I sort of still like to think of it that way. This is why arguably you shouldn't make your cage before you've got the ball. I I don't really like it as a tactic. He's gonna go another one, isn't he? Yep. I mean I guess we could cage dive this. With the garbo, right? I know we have to go two squares to... Oh, no, we don't, actually. We can do it this like this. Hey, legendary... Uh, is that Phoenix there? It's in dark for me, so I can't quite see. Uh, let's pop it... Here. That's a two dice against, isn't it? If only I had somebody I could get over there. Come on, Ogre, don't both down me for once. Thank you. Oh, hello. How's it going, Legendary? I'm going to call you Phoenix, actually. That feels more sensible. As a, as a shortening. Alright, nice. I'm trying to recover a game that has gone really, really badly. I don't know if you play Blood Bowl... But I was just explained to Dweebe, like, the rolls have been kind of outrageously poor. I mean, if I do that, I can get a one dice. Honestly, maybe I just go here and just try and hit it anyway. You have yet to play versus play. Oh, okay, nice. Rain, okay, nice. I mean, I'm a, I'm, I'm British. So I'm a big fan of rain. All right, pushes is, pushes is fine. We'll just push him in here. I mean, he's, he's a gut runner, so he can get out of this. Do you have a favorite team? Mine is dark elf, so I don't know what I'm doing here. Just, just being a glutton for punishment. Really, I'm just testing out the renegades, because they seem sort of. Uh, I mean, they seem fun on paper. Oh, it, it hurts to see all the pairs. Oh, it really hurts to see all the pairs. Oh, I don't know what's... I don't I don't know what's going on in this game. I really wish I had the stats. Playing AI, it's hard to judge. That's that's fair. The AI is, uh, is horrible, let's face it. Hey, dub skulls. Oh, last reroll here. He probably, he sh probably should get this in as fast as he can and get 2-0 up and be safe. Because he's in a situation now where everything could go wrong. Yeah, I know. I mean, this is not what I expected in terms of the casualty distribution. I guess we do have one there. If 
he doesn't go in, we might still be able to make something happen. And if he does go in, he might fall over, so... We'll see. Yeah, the AI is... I, I only played... I think I played one or... I played against the AI for some reason. I think I was testing... How the game... Oh, he's just going to run it in. Go on, fall over. Go on, you can do it. You're not stopping there, are you? Oh, he is stopping there. Oh, his Rat Ogre has been so good as well. Which isn't great. So if the Rat Ogre hadn't made it here, we could have one dice this and then dodged out here to go blitz him. As it is, we could do a 3 plus, 2 plus. Oh, maybe not. Hang on, let's see what... Yeah, okay. Oh, how far are you... Okay, you're just going that far. Uh, can we chain push anything here? Not quite. If we had somebody here, we'd chain push the rat into that. You get the ogre over to nowhere very useful. Here, would that help? No, not really. I mean, I think it's still worth doing. You guys are just getting up. Yeah, there's no there's no good chain push here, so I think we just gotta dodge this guy through. We do have 59 rerolls, apparently. Does doing that help here at all? It doesn't, unfortunately. So I don't think I can do that. Especially with Alona, because the reroll's not going to work. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll reroll everything. Oh, never mind. Did we... Did we hurt ourselves as well? Yeah, we injured ourselves. Okay, he'd be okay after the game though. <laughs> even even with dodge and jamming in a reroll there, it wasn't enough. There's just this game is not happening. How many actually injured are we? We're three injured, so even if he goes in here, which he's got really not much incentive to. These guys are arm value 9 plus, right? Yeah, they are, okay. Rain, I wouldn't go by this game for, uh, uh for, for uh, an optimistic view. <clears throat> It's going, it's going rather poorly. I was, yeah, I was, I was saying before, before you got here that in the first half, um, I think five of our eight turns, we, we, uh, turned over on the first, on the first block of the turn, which is, makes it really hard to make anything happen. Uh, it's not always that way, but this has been a particularly, uh, stunning display of, of just did he did he animal savagery did he re-roll the animal savagery or did he not hurt himself but then hurt me because that that's not cool at least if he's going to fail animal savagery he could you know he could have his own guy die but oh he's going in okay i mean why not Maybe he's feeling like, well, I can score some more here. We get one KO back. That's not great. So we're going to have... Uh, whoa, we're not going to have many players. One, two, three, four, five, six. We're going to have five players. Wow. Did we get our... We didn't get our Dark Elf back either, so... What can you do? Uh... <laughs> I'm going to put these guys here, 
in the hopes that it's not a deep kick. It kind of doesn't matter anymore. What? We got stunned. And they got stunned. Okay. I'm not going to try and understand, I'm just going to accept it. Um, I mean, there's literally nowhere safe to go now. Come on, pick it up for me. Thank you. Let's see if we can at least bash some stuff. I mean, that would be a nice sort of way to... Okay. <laughs> hey, we knocked somebody over. It is still possible. Oh, apparently that... Oh, yeah, that guy got stunned, didn't he? Hey, look at that. Oh. That's exciting. Okay. -o. All right. Suddenly, suddenly it's all turned around. What we kind of want, in our own way is for him to run his entire team past our team, down here. And then we're going to do the pass of the century. To, uh... I guess probably the Orc, in fairness. He is Agility 3+. plus. What a game. I don't know if we've got any... Okay, that one's a bad one. I think. Oh, that might just be missed next. I don't know if he has anything else though. It's not telling me... I th think he's okay. I think this guy's alright long term. He was okay. I think. He's just KO. Okay, yeah. So, like long term wise, we're okay-ish. Oh, he did run his entire team down here. I mean, there's only really one thing to do at this point. Get him. Very nice. Five plus, four plus. Oh, that was close. Um, why is he suddenly... Oh, I don't know what's happening now. I guess because the pass is happening. Not sure. Uh, inaccurate. So it's going to be an inaccurate after the re-roll. I don't know where it's going to go. I don't think he's realized that this is his decision here. Hopefully he will soon, otherwise we're going to have to sit here for seven minutes. <clears throat> Modificateur. Why why do we suddenly have French showing up? That's interesting. Our opponent paused the game. That's a weird decision. I I d I can't he can't have done surely. But honestly, I don't know. Maybe... Oh! Oh, hopefully the game hasn't glitched. Out. Maybe the game's glitched out for him. 
Uh, I guess we'll see. Maybe it's a good time to actually, for him, his best bet might be to actually just quit the game and reload it and see if it sorts it out. Because it's, I get, I'm, my guess is this that it's stuck. Um. <clears throat> so I don't think I've been in the situation. Uh, so I don't know if that's the best thing. But I mean, I don't think it would hurt necessarily either because it does at least uh you know like the game's good about reconnecting now but i haven't come across this situation before so i guess we're gonna we're gonna wait and see what happens uh which is a bit unfortunate i think it's good our end because nothing it's it's definitely waiting on him it's got the red ring around it's definitely an inception situation but yeah this is um it's been it's been a very rough game i think i think the you know skaven are a scary team to play against uh cuz of their gut runners but they they normally don't outbash you. Um, we we really had the short end of the stick on that. Uh, we the, we never really got allowed to get into the game, and by the time we might have had any kind of chance, we were already down so many players from the counter blocks. Okay, so he's 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 um, DC'd and he's gonna try and reconnect, I imagine, and maybe that'll sort out the issue. Uh, but yeah. Now, if had this have been before they uh, sorted out the... There we go. Before they sorted out the reconnection thing, um, he'd have been screwed because if he had left the match... Because I did have one before they fixed that. And if you leave the match, you... Um, you can't... You couldn't get back in. Oh, look at this. Uh, yeah, I mean, we've got to re-roll it. Oh. So. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we need we just need too many rolls so. I mean, we were going to lose the ball anyway. So, that's a good thing to have learned there if it causes issues. Then uh you know, uh, a dis uh, disconnect and reconnect. So we've got, how do we only have four players? Do we have five players technically? One, two, three. We technically have five players, yeah. Down goes the ogre. Not the ogre, the troll. Did he scatter the ball? That was risky. Now he's put it into two tackle zones. I don't know why you'd want to do that. Yeah, I think he could have just pushed the troll here and then grabbed it with the gut runner, but now he's actually made it harder for himself. Oh, the ogre refuses to catch it. Which is not surprising in fairness. Um, let's see. Get him. Oh dear. Okay. This this has been a this has been our game. Did we KO ourselves? We did. This is very much being how this game has gone. If you wanted an encapsulation of, of the pain. But that's Blood Bowl for you. Sometimes it's uh it's it doesn't work <laughs> the way you want it to. I mean we absolutely should have not being the one that got KO'd there, but... we just got to finish this match off and, I don't know, maybe I'll try another one today? Can, uh, this, this game is not being super quick either though, unfortunately, because... I mean, I guess our turns have been quick. Maybe it hasn't been that slow.
he's making it harder on himself to score here, but I mean, it should work out. It's like he's trying to get the ogre to catch it somehow. It's a very odd decision making. 45 men. Okay. Oh yeah, I guess I could just check the... Uh... I do need to have some dinner. At some point. I, I hate to for this to be the game that I played today though. And that be it. Yeah, the fouling hasn't really been too much of a problem. I guess he did stun us. I mean, honestly, probably the best thing to do is just end turn here. End turn. You're good, you're good. Yeah. I mean, that's, you know, if we get it over in the next couple turns, that will have been a quick game. Uh, I was trying to work out if there was anything I could do to... That's not worth it. Let's get this game over. Yeah, exactly. I mean, it double sucks because we, we started and ended with a bad loss. I mean, the one thing I'll say about this game is there was nothing I could... Like, I, I honestly think there was nothing I could have done to make this game better. So in that sense, I can feel like, well, at least... You know... At least it was not, like, a bad... It wasn't bad plays on my part that put us here. I can just be like, well, that's... Blood Bowl just being Blood Bowl. Let's let's do the unnecessary foul. Finish off. We'll probably get sent off. I hope so. There we go. Classic. Yeah, let's argue. Nice. It's a good way to end. So we ended with three players on the field, I think. What a disaster. Uh, we got ourselves an MVP, though. I mean, you know, there's that. We got some experience. Not very much experience. Oh, it's a bit brutal that it doesn't give you much experience on the blood pass for playing a game. And, like, I feel like it should congratulate you for playing the game in general, in terms of the blood pass, rather than give you extra for the win, because it's supposed to be a thing that encourages you to play rather than encourages you to win, right? Like, encouraging you to win is just inherent within the game. Um, so I feel like getting less for losing is a bit counterproductive. It's making it feel... you, you want to make people losing feel as good as possible, right? In the sense that you want people to keep playing even when they're having a bad time. Or maybe you don't. Maybe maybe we just got... The only reason I say that we got that it feels like we got less is because normally I go up an entire level when, when we win. Uh, but maybe you're right. Maybe maybe that is a thing. I, I don't know. It goes by how long the game is. Oh, that seems that seems wrong as well. But uh, that would be fair enough. Okay, we're going to get an Apo because our guys are very injury prone. That's what they said. Okay. Well, then that's that's fair. Um, in that case, I'm going to say they should give you more for losing. Would people actively lose if they gave you more for losing? I don't know. If, I don't know that you would because that's a pretty brutal way to get experience. So he is just missed next game. That's that's pretty great. Uh, our team is a bit broken. Our Dark Elves are in a much better spot. Um, got a full team. We are... What are we at right now? Oh, we have to go here. So we're 2 zero, one with them. And with these, with the Dark Elves, we're 11 3 1. So we're doing a whole lot better. 
I didn't... I don't know what you get for three big guys right from the start. Um, I will say, with the way our blocking dice have gone, it would have been even more of a disaster, because we, we've we not been able to get anything going. I'm guessing you compromise rerolls, which we, we badly needed. Uh, I do want three big guys. It was just... And we would have three big guys now if the ogre hadn't died. Um, the ogre dying first game put us behind the ball. Like we would, we would definitely have three by now. You can you can get two. Okay. So yeah, we started with the ogre and the troll this time. Uh, we lost the ogre first game, even though we managed to get the result. I I've, I've just replaced him, and then when we can afford it, we'll get the rat ogre in as well. Yeah. Yeah, so I started the team the first time, and our ogre died. I was like, well, let's start again. So we started the team again. It was actually our own rat ogre that killed our um, ogre with uh, animal savagery. So that was, I, I guess you could say, amusing. <laughs> um, so we started again, and then the very next game, our ogre died again. Um, not to animal savagery this time, but still it was... Not what you expect. It's the sort of player on the team that you don't think is going to die. Um, I think a lime, a lime or two have died as well. It's been a very, very squishy team, uh, unfortunately. So I suppose we are playing with us a, a somewhat behind the behind the curve team. What time are we on? Maybe we can play another one. Uh. Do we dare? Uh, we could. Can't go as badly as that, surely. Surely it can't go that poorly again. Alright, let's finish the uh, video for this one. Thanks for watching YouTube. I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye for now.